here, folks, today. I went all the way up in the hills, right? The hills of Miss Maloya. I didn't go to the beach today. I went somewhere else. This spot is a spot they call L.E. And yeah, it's one of the most beautiful spots I have been to while here in Mexico. As you can see, I'm here early in the day. It's like around 12, 1 o'clock. You know what I mean? And there's not too many people here at all. You probably can get a nice seat, eat, you know what I mean? If you want some quiet time to yourself, this would be the time of day to do it. But come 2 o'clock, it's more and more a lot of people come. We got zip lining for all ages. This little line right in front of us, that's for like six shows, they said. Oh yeah, this is amazing, amazing place that y'all got to. If you hear Miss Maloya or in Puerto Vallarta, this guy, this is this is a, a must-see. Only problem is it's not easy getting here. Alright? There's a dirt road that looks like nothing but four wheelers come up. But if you got the right vehicle, you can make it up here. Anybody needs a ride up here? Just let me know, hit me up in my inbox. You know what I mean? And we'll make arrangements to get you out here. There you see. You can catch the <coughs> these little golf cart things. Whatever you want to call them up here. Or if you want, you can get the four wheelers. All those are different tours that they offer here in Vallarta. Four wheeler tour probably is amazing. I was I, I drove up and down these hills, so I know they had a ball coming up here on these things. Then of course they got the buses in the back. If you can see them. Mm -hmm. Or you could drive your own vehicle. If you're priv privileged to have one. You know what I mean? But it looks like it starts to get jumping around two o'clock. Yeah, yeah, I can't lie. I like this little spot. Everything I love in one spot. Look at that pool going on. Man. Look at this little waterfall, this little bridge. Guess this little section right here for private parties. But well, that's cool. Gotta reserve that. If you wanted to get in these hammocks, you come down these little steps. You live right on the hammocks. You know what I mean?
Nah, I know what I'm trying to go find. Find me a smoke spot. <laughs> but guess what? The waiters looked out. You know what I mean? They told me you can't smoke here. The only thing you can smoke here is weed. <laughs> I said, well, that's all I smoke, so <coughs> we good. <laughs> So we good in the hood. I think I found me a spot, y'all. Got me a cave. So I go up in the cave, y'all. Go smoke in the cave. Ain't a big cave, it's just a little hole. And this is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, y'all. Beautiful. Them elephant areas right there. They thriving in their natural habitat. See what this sign say, folk. I'm talking about butterflies that can be found here. It's a lot of butterflies. There's more stuff back here, folks. Oh, yeah. Guess that's a zip line platform right there. Oh, this is beautiful back here, y'all. And it looks like it goes farther back. Look at this thing. Nice little pool right here underneath the waterfall. Let's see what's up these steps. Steps are sturdy, folks. Don't don't worry about how they look. They nice and they nice and sturdy. Oh man, look at that! Look at this pool on top of the cliff. Well, I might meditate on that, y'all. I didn't expect the pool. I thought it was just the cliff. That's a pool. Well, I can see there's people here now. Here at the table. It's beautiful up here, though.
Yeah, folks. Al Eden. Place to be, y'all. Yeah, I'm back in the jungle, black on the side of the cliff. Y'all know where I like it at. <laughs> yeah, I like it in wilderness and nature, you know? Look at that. This little fish swimming around in there and everything. <laughs> 